Hi, it's James from James Show. Thank you guys for watching my Cringe Halloween series. Um, I actually did a lot more this year. Like, I went to Scream Machine, Hush, and Hollow Weekends. Um, but unfortunately, I didn't really film in any of those. The two haunted houses, there was really no point because I couldn't film inside of them. And this year, we uh, rode a bunch more rides at Cedar Point. So. Quack, quack. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, hey, buddy. Uh, don't be shy. Why are you hiding over in that corner? Well, come on over, champ, and let me tell you all about it. Halloween is the best time of the year. It's a time for monsters and ghouls, ghosts, gremlins, and aliens just like you. Boop! Adults go out and get scared in haunted attractions where creatures and, well, they're actually just people, they hide and they jump out and scare you. And yes, we pay money for it because we enjoy it. It's like in our nature. Children dress up as all kinds of spooky things and they go house to house and bug people for candy. We call this trick-or-treating. Now being your first year outside of Area 51 and the fact that, well, you're tiny, maybe this year we can take you trick-or-treating. Oh yeah? What would you like to be? Fitting, fitting. Like, but you can be anything. You can literally be anything you want to be, bud. Quack, quack! Ah, this guy's got jokes. You know what? Let me see if I can round you up a costume. Okay, peeps. I got the perfect costume for you, bud. Now, I went and looked through the closet. Uh, I couldn't find anything. But, uh, I found this out back. And I think it'll fit your head perfectly. How about you be a Comcast worker? Sound good, bud? Quack, quack. I knew you'd love it. Another Halloween tradition is watching scary movies. Yes, uh, people actually do watch movies that are intended to scare them. If you're like me, it doesn't really work. I'm, I'm not easily startled. But for a lot of people, it gives them quite the scare. Now, there are other movies that come out around this time that a lot of people watch, such as Nightmare Before Christmas, which a lot of people don't know if it's really a Halloween or a Christmas movie. That's easily debatable. And then if you're a white girl, of course you want to see Hocus Pocus. Some people like to be nostalgic, and uh, they watch like Goosebumps and Are You Afraid of the Dark? Stuff like that from their childhood. I mean, from my childhood. That's when I was a kid. But like a lot of people watch 80s horror and like all your classic stuff like that. Now, peeps, do you think you're ready for Halloween? <laughs> Me too. This is James from James Show, and Happy Halloween. Jesus Christ, my eyebrows getting bushy. Alright, dude, I know, I know you live an hour away, but you and Mitt need to come down and do an episode. People have been wondering why you haven't been in the episodes lately. Oh, hi, Mitt. Anyways, so come on down. Just come down for an episode, dude. It's not that difficult. I can only make Matt eat so many gross and hot things here, dude. Catch. Just take that. Hell no. Take, take a big bite. Hell fucking no, I ain't See, trying he, to die. He's not even kid. willing to do it anymore, come on. Hell no. Hey guys, it's James Show back here, and um, I guess I'm going to make Mid eat some more gross things. Today we're going to start out with... Uh... Um, I can't, I can't do this anymore. So what'd you think? It was pretty damn good. Well... I'd say he loved it. So, uh, wait. Are you alright? Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! He's fine. <laughs> Ellie, I know you live about an hour away, but yet. Yeah. yeah, Ellie, I mean, I know you live about an hour away, but you need to come down here. People are asking questions about why, and you. Uh, God damn it. I mean, come on, dude. Just come down for an episode. It's not that difficult. I can only make you, uh, Matt. Uh, hmm. I'd say he loved it. Uh, are you all right? Yeah, I'm good. Oh, you're not supposed to say anything. Well, we're trying again because.